I know it's been a while, but I'm back with my latest project, the Latte Panda Alpha Nintendo Switch Project. Hey everyone, this is Project SPC, and I'm back with the latest iteration of my Nintendo Switch Latte Panda Alpha project. I spent a considerable time learning Fusion 360, and this is the payout. So this is going to be a three-part series. First one is show you some of the features. You can see this actually in action. Next part is how to build it. And lastly, I'll show you how to pair the Joy-Cons to the Latte Panda Alpha. I have a new program that you can use that makes it very simple to pair and emulate an X input controller. Let's go over the features of this build. We have the 7 inch EDP touchscreen for the Latte Panda Alpha on the front. Joy-Con mounts on the side taken from a Nintendo Switch accessory. We have a sound card on the underside of this lid right here and a speaker right here. In a future build I will add a second speaker and a second set of mounting holes right here for stability. There's room over here for a 5000 milliamp light bulb battery pack which I'll leave a link to my tutorial in the description below. Large ventilation area right here. Access to USB ports on the top with additional ventilation. Access to the bottom ports here. And there is a built-in power button right here recessed into the case so you don't accidentally hit it. First up, we have one of my son's favorite racing games, Horizon Chase Turbo. It's a nice little racing game that you can find on Steam. Now before I get started, I do have a little bit of a disclaimer. Um, I found a problem with one of my LiPo battery packs. And uh, I kept shutting off every time the current draw got too large. So I do have another one on order so I can fix my battery pack. But for the time being, I am plugged in to the outlet. Next up is a game called Rivals of Ether, very similar to Super Smash Brothers. And of course, you don't have to use it in gaming mode, you can also use it as a tablet. And there you have it, my Nintendo Switch Latte Panda Alpha project. Some considerations for the future, I would like to add a second speaker. It is quite soft and I don't think it would be playable in a subway environment or somewhere loud without headphones. So I will add a second speaker in a future revision. So to keep myself honest with you guys, I will be releasing the STL files below. Feel free to download them and start printing them. 
I will give a full build video here in the next few days once I finish videoing that and editing it. There are two versions. There's one with the Joy-Con mount recess, and then there's a, just a tablet version, so you don't necessarily need it to do gaming. So if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button, maybe even subscribe, and thank you for watching. Also, come check out my Discord channel. A few people have joined in. I am posting pictures of my build as it goes along, so you guys can get sneak peek previews of my projects as they progress.